Brain Gain The Future of Brain Technology What type of brain technology could become a part of our lives in the near future? BCI Technology Although brain-computer interface technology already exists, it is set to become even more widely used in the future. One area where BCI technology is particularly useful is in that of people with paralysis or other similar conditions. For example, the famous scientist Stephen Hawking used a computer interface in order to generate speech. In the future, we can expect even more sophisticated systems such as brain-controlled prosthetic limbs and thought-powered smartphones. Neural Dust Scientists have been developing neural dust that would allow our brains to communicate digitally with the world around us. So far, they have managed to get one of these tiny devices to detect which neurons are firing and are now working on making the device stimulate neurons in response to radio signals. The creators of this technology hope that in the future, this amazing implant will be capable of firing nerve impulses in motor areas of the brain and will allow paralyzed people to walk again. Mini Brains Scientists have managed to grow a tiny 3D brain using stem cells. This amazing breakthrough allows scientists to learn so much more about brain disorders and how the brain works without harming any people. Scientists have been experimenting with giving these brains a blood supply, which gives them the potential to grow much bigger. These larger brains even have the potential to receive an input, allowing scientists to further investigate the sensory and association areas of the brain. Thought-powered typing. Speech recognition technology is not really appropriate for use in office settings or in public. The Silent Speech Project is currently working to harness the signals from your brain and turn them into words, allowing you to type using your thoughts. This technology could allow us to type up to 100 words a minute, much faster than any current BCI speech generation technology.